Well, hello again, everyone. Professor Prophet coming to you from Gamblers University. And we've got an interesting roulette strategy for you this evening. This is one of those that starts off with just small coverage, and then we kind of migrate across the board as we have losses. Uh, these are uh, This is one of the strategies that I like to uh, use where we start small and, and grow. Uh, that way, if we happen to hit some of these early numbers, these early bets, we win a lot of money, and that's always a good thing. Now this one's called the 522, and we'll explain to you when we get down to the play field why we call it that. Uh, now we hope you enjoy the video. If you do, we ask that you give us the old thumbs up, and that way we know you're enjoying the content. Also, if you have any comments on how we might uh, tweak this particular strategy to make it even better, we would appreciate hearing from you on that. Uh, finally, if you have not already subscribed to the Gamblers University channel, we'd love to have you go ahead and hit that button and become part of the student body here at Gamblers U. Now, as always, we do suggest you try these strategies on your software at home or your table at home before you take them to the casino. Be sure you're comfortable betting them and be sure you're confident that they can win you some money. So let's head on down to the play field now and we'll uh, discuss the nuts and bolts of the 522 strategy, exactly how we bet it, exactly how it progresses, and then we'll spin the wheel for a few minutes See if we can win some of that sweet, sweet casino cash. So we'll see you down there shortly. Okay, everyone down here on the virtual roulette table, getting ready to spin our 522 strategy. Now, this is a $1,000 buy-in, which means our win goal is going to be $100. Now, the way this works, we start off with a $5 bet on the 4-9 double street and the 10-15 double street. And then we add in $2 bets on the 4-8 corner, the 5-9 corner, the 10-14, and the 11-15 corners. So each row there, we've got 5, 2, and 2 on our bets, so 5-22. Now, if we lose, we'll expand across the board. And uh, by the time we get the board filled up, if we continue to lose, which hopefully we won't, but if we do, we'll have 30 numbers covered, so we should start hitting some and hopefully get back to our uh, session high pretty quickly. So $18 bet on the initial one. Let's go ahead and get it spinning and see if we can get off to a good start here. And one's the number, one red, so that's going to be a loss. So we'll just rebet, and then what we're going to do is add in the 1621 double street, and then the two corner bets, 1620 and 1721, so that's a $27 bet. And we'll spin again. So there's eight red, so that's going to bring us to our session high. Um, so we're going to go back, back to our base level. So we're at $21. So let's uh, rebet and then we'll clear out these uh, latest bets. So back to $18. And we're spinning. Here we go. There's 34 red, so that's going to be a loss. So that puts us at uh, $3 now. So we need to add on that next uh, level here. That's $5 on the 16 through 21, and then $2 on those two corner bets. We're back up to a $27 bet, and we are spinning. Here we go. 13 black, so that's a $21 win. So that puts us at 24. That's a new session high. So let's go ahead and clear out these uh, latest bets and go back to our base level of 18. And we're spinning. Here we go. 23 red. So that's going to be a loss. So uh, you know the routine. We'll rebet and we'll add in this 1621. And then the $2 bet on the 1620. And the 1721, and we're spinning. And that's 22 black. So that's another loss. So we'll rebet. And let's see, we got one too many here. Let's get that one out of the way. There we go. So uh, we lost at that level, so we'll go to the next level and we'll put a $5 bet on the 2227 double street. 
and a two dollar bid on the 22 26 and 23 27 corners and now we'll move up to the next level which means uh, up five dollars on the five dollar bets and two dollars on all the two dollar bets and that's a 72 dollar bet total now uh, down 22 on the session and looking for a hit so there's 11 black that is going to be a nice hit for us that's a $60 win, so that puts us at $38, which is a new session high. So we'll rebet and then we'll back everything back down to our base level, which is $18. Oops, one too many. And let's spin again. Here we go. Session goal is 100, of course. And there's 36 red, so that's a loss. So we'll rebet these and add in the 1621 and then the two corner bets for two dollars each. Twenty-seven dollar total bet, and we're spinning. Twenty-seven red, so that's going to be another loss. So we will go ahead and rebet and add in another double streets, 2227. For five and then two on the two corner bets and then we'll go up five on all the five dollar bets and up two on all the two dollar bets that puts us at seventy two dollars and we're spinning so thirty one blacks the number and that's another loss that's the first time we've lost at this level so now we'll go to the next level and that's a ten dollar bet on the twenty eight thirty three and then four dollar bet on the 2832 and the 2933 and then we'll go um, up a level on everything else so that puts those at six on all the corner bets bring these up to six now i'm thinking about it and then we'll add another one another level to the five dollar bet so it'll bring those up to 15 each so now we're at 135 dollars and you can see why we need the thousand dollar buy-in now as we've hit a bit of a cold streak 30 numbers covered now so we should start hitting a few so there's 129 black for a 63 dollar win so we'll take that and just rebet and we're sitting at minus 16 Session high is 38, so we still have a little uh, ground to make up. And there's 21 red, so that's going to be a $9 win. So rebet and spin again. Here we go. 24 black, so that's going to be another $9 win. And the real money is in that middle column. If we can hit some of those middle numbers, middle column numbers. Uh, we should make this up pretty quickly. So there's three red. Unfortunately, that's going to be another loss. That's a $135 loss. So now we've got to go up another level. So we add $5 to all the $5 bets and $2 to all the $2 bets. And see if we can get on a roll here and hit some of these uh, middle column numbers. And make up some ground here. Down 133 now on the session. And there's a middle column at 11 black. So that's an $84 win. So that'll help. So we'll stay at this level and spin again. Down 49 now. And there's 17 black. That's another middle column win. An $84 win. And that puts us at 35. Uh, session high is 38. That's close enough for me. We're going to go back down to the base level anytime you can find an excuse to uh, lower your volatility. Uh, go ahead and take it. So this is an $18 baseline bet. And we're spinning. Sitting at $35 now on the session. And there's 15 black. So that is a $30 win. That's a nice win for us. So we'll rebet. And spin again, sitting at 65 now, new session high. And there's the green monster, so that's going to be a loss. 
So we'll rebet these and then add in the uh, 1621 5 and two dollar bets on the 1620 and 1721 double streets. Twenty-seven dollar total bet, and we're spinning. Twenty-two black is the number, and that's just off, so we lose there. So we'll rebet these, and we'll add in the twenty-two twenty-seven double street and the two corner bets. And then we're going to increase everything, the $5 bets by $5, and the $2 bets by $2. So now we're at a $72 total bet, and sitting at a $20 profit. And there's seven red, so that's going to be a $24 profit. And that puts us at $44. Session high, of course, is 65 so we'll stay right here and see if we can hit another one here. 23 red, so that's going to be a middle column. That'll be a good payoff for us. That's a $60 win. And so that puts us at $104. And just like that, that meets our session goal. So that is how the 522 roulette strategy works. We started off with a $1,000 buy in, ended up at $1,104. That's a $104 win. And uh, I hope you, uh, we played that long enough for you to kind of get the gist of how that works. Uh, again, it's one where we start off with just a small portion of the board covered. In this case, the uh, just 12 numbers. And then if we lose, we'll increase it to 18 numbers. And then if we lose again, we'll increase it to 24 numbers. And go up a level. And if we lose again, we'll increase to 30 numbers covered. And that only leaves 8 of them uncovered. And we'll bring everything up another level. That would put everything at 6 on the uh, corner bits. And 15 on the $5 bets, the double street bets. Now, if we lost again, we would add another 5 to these uh, double street bets and another 2 to all the corner bets. And we would continue to do this on losses. If we lost again, we'd just go up another 5 on the $5 bets and 2 on the $2 bets. And we would continue doing that on losses until. Uh, we uh, either started to win and reached a session high where we'd go back to our base level or we'd go broke and lose our entire $1,000 bankroll. But uh, this was a winning session, so that's always a good thing uh, to walk away with a little of that sweet, sweet casino cash in your pocket. Uh, so we do hope you enjoy this. If you did, we ask that you give us a thumbs up. And also, if you haven't already subscribed to the Gamblers University channel, we'd sure love to have you go ahead and do that at this time. Uh, we do uh, three videos a week, and we'd love to have you be part of the student body here at Gamblers U. Once again, we do thank you for watching, and hope you'll come back and join us again real soon. Until that time, if you're out there spinning that wheel, we wish you nothing but the best of luck. We hope all your spins come up winners. Talk to you again soon. Bye-bye.